Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how, in regards to Unity, even though I'm not having Unity up because I don't need to for this, uh, in C Sharp, how to use the wait for seconds command, because it seems to be a little tricky, right? So based on the documentation, I actually look it up anyway, it's pretty basic. So all you have to do is you're going to create a function this way. So instead of creating something like void fire, you would create IE numerator because that's that's a keyword here and then you can name your function and then in here you can actually do yield and then do the wait for a second so I'm just saying return because obviously that's what the function is going to return so I'm yield is the word you need and I'm just going to use a return function for this so you, you can use wait for seconds in a different way but this is how I'm using it here because uh, it's based on a shooting command for an enemy to not have an insane fire rate. But, so wait four seconds, this is waiting one second. So, then, this isn't being called, right? Where do you call it? How do you call it, right? Okay, so where and how you call it, you go where you want to call it. I want to call it in my update function and a double nested statement. So, uh, double nested if statement. And then, you have to say start coroutine. You have to. Then you say the name of the function you made. Now see how it's reload lowercase? Because this was reload lowercase. Uh, I hope this was helpful and uh, yeah, have fun with that.